My dad's probably the largest guy in life that I've ever met. It's a very bizarre experience for me to see that car. I see it and I just wish I had like a hand grenade and just toss it in the thing. DeLorean was the biggest name in the American motor industry. Who was this maverick who was going to make this dream car? This is going to be a very successful project. He was irreverent. John was like a rock star. The word charisma was almost invented for John. As I said, I'm a, just an engineer who builds cars. I don't understand these things. The British government is committed to John DeLorean and his company to the tune of 84 million pounds. This was his dream. Well, everything seemed to be going so well for him. You see this whole other side to John DeLorean. Everything in John's life was motivated by status and money. The British government were desperate for investments. John DeLorean was desperate for money. I told him, I said, John, I think you're making a mistake. You're taking money out of the company. It's going to come out at some point in time. Everything was falling apart. He made promises that he couldn't keep. He is a desperate guy trying to do everything to keep this company afloat. He impressed me as being somebody who was going to crash. He said, I have made millions and lost millions, and half the fun is getting it all back. That night in New York changed my life forever. And that's when the sweater just started unraveling. You couldn't tell my father what to do. If John could get away with something, he would. Hi, David, how are you? Oh, everything's perfect.